Ah, good morning. Hello, buds. Good morning to you too. <laughs> Bit of YouTube and coffee. Hello, Andrew. So, today, mm. hipster. Let's go. Let's check the boom and how to build this model. Doesn't seem that much hard. No special tips in this boom, so will be pretty straight. I start from the IC. This is the first one that I made. The orientation is pretty the same like always. The right on the IC should be the same on the panel. Same orientation. Anyway, you can check on the pictures if you oriented them good. There are a lot of them in tapes there. And this is how it look when we finish the first row of IC. Actually all the ICs in the hipster build. And now we can move on diodes. There are actually two kinds of diodes. The first one that I will place are the Zener, which have a different symbol on the PCB, you will see it. And they are placed there I think to give a voltage of 4.7, something like that. Anyway. They are pretty different on the PCB. They look the same, so don't open them all on the table or we'll, you will get confused for sure. These are the Zener. And these are the standard diodes that we always use. Okay, this other model here, you should check the line that will indicate you the orientation. And there is a dot on the PCB that will tell you which orientation should go to dial. Now we have this. They are for the four LEDs that the hipster have so they are four exactly like the number of the leds so if one of your leds will not work you know where is your problem oh yeah i forgot we need to cook today pasta with tuna So after lunch, we go back to work, a bit of university with friends. Hello, Andrew. And now we can move on and finish our hipster. We need resistors and capacitors. But I will show you only the 100k resistor, how I place them, because usually it's the same for all of them, so you know already the procedure.
so I just finished to place all the resistors uh, here as you can see and I placed also the um, capacitors and there is one thing that I want to tell you before we go on uh, I want to tell you that for the LED I used blue and uh, I will use blue and uh, red LEDs and the resistor that I'm using which is okay for them it's uh, 4k7 resistors uh, and I place them all already because I'm sure that it will work now we move on and we place the headers female and male to connect together the two PCB that we have place always pots jacks and here we have two switches which are pretty easy to place they are not polarized or anything are normal switches so you just place them in this position Now we can move on finally and solder the pots and some of the jacks and the switches of course. In these jacks that I have is missing the one little piece so we need to take the true whole components legs to place that and go to solder them. So I didn't add from the past buildings some that I cut it. So if you are sensible please skip the video in this moment because I'm going to kill some LEDs. Okay now that we have the legs of the LEDs we can place them and solder them on our PCB. These are the four LEDs that I used for the hipster. They are bipolar and they are red blue so when we got high ray they became like purple and I liked it a lot. So we connect our PCBs and we're ready, we finished. Just need to check now the continuity and we can try our model in the case. blinking it's a good sign and here is the purple more or less you can't see it but in real life trust me it's purple <laughs> so it works This is it for today so if you enjoy time with me if you like please leave a like subscribe and see you in the next video